Okay, I'm just gonna give you a quick run through today's setup. So we've got our frosty cold beers. After they've been sprayed a bit with some water, so we get some nice beads, give it a nice effect. In the backdrop, we've got a black sheet just across the reflective umbrella. I haven't used the reflective umbrella in the end. I managed to get a better view of the bottles and the amber colour by placing a piece of A4 paper folded to a sort of a triangle at the back end of the bottles, which then allowed the light that came up out of the carton to reflect back into the bottles. So we've got the carton under there, got a Cactus KF36 set at full power inside there. And it's being set off by the Cactus V2 remote. So we've got the remote hanging out the bottom there. And we've got the transmitter here. On the sides, we've got two white foam core boards that are providing some fill light and giving some definition to the outsides of the bottles, separating them from the black backdrop. We've got the Perspex sheet here, which is obviously there for holding the beers up for the light to come up. And in the foreground here, I placed a piece of black cardboard. So the black cardboard is just giving a bit of um, darkness to the edge of where our glass is, as we're getting a bit more light refracting from that from the flash. I've got this other white foam core board here that I'm positioning above the bottles, slightly tilted so that the front of the bottle receives more light to it. We've got the Canon 40D set at about 18 to 19 millimeters and we've got it set at 1 of a second which is my sync speed ISO 200 and an aperture of 6.7 setting a two second timer we can check that on the back of our display where certainly in our channels we've obviously got a spike at the back end of the channel but that's due to the black in the background so we can zoom in Got some nice definition on the water droplet and the gold looks real gold and you can actually see the top of the lid. So let's take the same shot without the use of the white foam core here. We lose the definition at the top of our bottles and don't get that same reflection down onto the necks of the bottles either and the front label doesn't look as effective. If we take away the phone call boards to the side and take the same image but this time we will use the top to give us some light. certainly fill in the tops of the bottle caps and the necks but we're losing a little bit of this bottle here around the edge you can see if we come across there in comparison to the other images also on the cactus uh, sorry also on the Canon 40D here I've got my polarizing filter so I've dialed that in just to get the reflections right so I can control whereabouts the reflections are on the bottle from the white foam core boards and the general flash coming from underneath. Just a bit of slight movement and taking a few shots to see what you get. So that's this week's shot for the Strobist Bootcamp Assignment 2 for 2011. It's time to have a cold one.